Eileen is saying, wow, this is marvelous for the final day of February. We'll experience more melting 60s this afternoon, 60s tomorrow, and 60s on Wednesday. Now, it does look slightly cooler on Thursday with some showers likely by Saturday, maybe even some thunderstorms. And the current conditions are showing 28 degrees right now with a real feel right around 21 and the winds out of the west at 7. Now, it's cold enough for some refreeze to occur, so if you did see some melting yesterday and many of you did and there were some puddles just be aware on those untreated sidewalks driveways parking lots it may be a bit icy in spots webster city you're starting off at 25 you can see around knoxville this morning at 34. the wind chill is noticeable but not horrible the winds at this point are fairly light out of the west and i think they'll stay that way throughout the day today thankfully no reduced visibility due to any fog temperatures this afternoon will be a talker. Those coming to and from Des Moines for girls state basketball are going to say, wow, it's warm in Des Moines. 60 degrees this afternoon and then tomorrow afternoon looks similar with temperatures even a few degrees warmer on Wednesday, especially along the southern border of the state. But this is a cold front coming through Wednesday afternoon, Wednesday night that will be cooling us down briefly, as I mentioned on Thursday. These are the clouds building in across the state, most of them right now in northern and western Iowa, and it looks completely dry throughout the day today. Now I want to show you the big picture of storm path here in case you do have travel plans to any of the surrounding states the next couple of days, mainly because we have no precipitation possible in central Iowa, but we do see a few weak systems brushing our state. Here's one in northeast Iowa Wednesday morning, and again, that's out ahead of that cold front. And then on Thursday, there will be a little light snow again out of the Dakotas, Minnesota, kind of brushing the northern border of the state. And on Friday, it looks like it will be cloudy and then it will be turning wet and potentially stormy by Saturday. And I'm talking thunderstorms today, partly sunny with the high of 61. The winds will stay out of the west at 5 to 15. Tonight, temperatures will only drop to 33. A few clouds, if you haven't already turned off the heat, do so. Just enjoy the 60s. On Tuesday, 61. On Wednesday, 64. On Thursday, 44. On Friday, 53. Scattered showers and thunderstorms on Saturday, 53. And on Sunday, 43. Today's weather rating is super high. I don't know if I mentioned this lady lately, but I have this middle school child who wears shorts and tank tops <laughs> on days like today. There will be some of those. It gets a 10. Now, would I recommend that with 60s for highs? No. Uh, kids had one of their friends yesterday running around in shorts and a t-shirt. I said, aren't you cold? He said, no, not really. Just my fingertips. I can't feel those. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, Kids. no, not really. <laughs> and it puts in perspective Iowa's weather. You know, right, it does. we made it in the 50s yesterday, and kids are out. In You're in a celebratory mood, right? Yeah. When it gets